Hello, everybody, and welcome to another installment of Biology from the Basement. Um, some of you may be tuning in for the first time. I did recommend on the Google Classroom site to watch this video first uh, to help you orient yourself through some of the videos that I've already shared um, on the site below. But since school officially starts today, you might be tuning in to Google Classroom for the first time today. So watch this video first and then all the rest of them you can just watch as needed. So um, the Google Classroom site will be your focal point for all assignments and due dates. Um, of course, also check into Google, or I mean, uh, uh, school tool for grades and such. I'm, I didn't get to Scantron your test before I left, so I'm going to be doing that the old school way today. Um, and I'll have your evolution tests up on school tool today um, as well. So there's that. Um, that covers uh, the big stuff. So let's get started with what we're going to talk about today. So here is your fact of the day so we can get started. And that is that in Belgium, there is an organization called Hero Rats, where they're using rats to sniff out landmines. Turns out that rats are better than metal detectors and dogs at sniffing out landmines. Uh, landmines that may have been left over from previous wars. And so rats are saving lives. So there's your fact of the day. So let's get started. Um, like I said, uh, for all information, stick to the classroom site. Um, it has all the information available to you. And that will be where your assignments and due dates will be available. One of the things that I did before I left on Monday, some of you may not have seen this, were my tips for success to get by on the next few weeks until spring break, right? Because class officially starts today and we will be having two and a half hours of work every day, half hour each. Uh, don't worry, I'll keep you busy. Here were my tips, right? Get up at a reasonable hour and eat breakfast. Nobody says you have to get up at 8 or 9 a.m., but get up in the morning, eat some breakfast, start your day with some energy. Also, make a daily schedule. The Andracos have made a daily schedule so that the boys will do their schoolwork. We've also included outdoors time and uh, TV time, right? We've scheduled in fun and work for them in their day. Um, another thing is make your bed. Your room looks 100 times better when you just whoosh, throw that comforter over your bed and walk away and it looks a little fresher in there. Another one is put on pants. It feels like you get a lot more done and you're actually starting a day if you put on pants. I got my pants, I even put my nice bow tie on because uh, I wanna feel like I'm gonna get something done today. So I felt like dressing up a little bit so that we'll get something accomplished um, even though we're um, stuck here in my basement. Um, you can spend time outside, right? We're not on complete lockdown. We're just social distancing. So make sure that you get outside, get some fresh air. Uh, the boys have um, been catching Pokemon out there. Um, but whatever you want to do, ride a bike, go for a hike, um, get, get outside and get some fresh air. It really helps. Um, another one is practice good hygiene. If you have noticed since my recent videos, I have given myself a beardy trim and hairy cut. Um, I gave Sam a haircut as well, and there wasn't much screaming and crying involved, so I think I did all right. Um, but keep your body clean, right? Wash your face. That just feels good sometimes. Um, help out around the house, right? Clean up yourself a nice little workspace. I help my wife get her art space together. The boys have a workspace. Um, I have a, a nice workspace down here with a computer and iPads and all kinds of technology. Not just my, my instruments anymore. Um, it is a multi-purpose workspace. Um, and so that's really nice uh, to have uh, space to do things like learn or practice your hobby. Um, I'm hoping to play a lot more bass as well as do some woodworking and some other projects that I have planned around the house because 
the busier your hands and your body are, the less busy your mind is with worry. Um, because the key here is to stay positive. This isn't going to last forever, right? We just have to practice good social distancing and good hygiene, and in no time, uh, things will start to look like normal again. And um, just be positive, and um, I will post a video every day so that you can see me. Uh, I miss you guys already. Um, this isn't going to be quite as fun without interacting with you guys day to day. So I look forward to a time when we will be in class together again. So signing off from biology from the basement. Have a good week.